XCOM Enemy Unknown is a turn-based strategy game released in 2012. In the game, players control the XCOM organization, a military organization tasked with the defending game is divided Earth against into two alien parts, invasion, base management and tactical combat. In the base management section, players build and expand their base, recruit and train soldiers, research new technologies, and manage resources. In the tactical combat section, players control a squad of soldiers in turn-based battles against the alien invaders. XCOM Enemy Unknown is considered one of the, the seven nerve-wracking strategy games of the 2010s. First, for several the reasons. game is difficult, with a high level of challenge that forces players to think strategically and carefully Second, plan their moves. The game's permadeath system means that if a soldier dies in combat, they are gone for good, adding a sense of tension and Third, urgency to battle. The game's randomized elements, such as mission objectives and alien positioning, keep players on their toes and make each playthrough Overall, unique. XCOM Enemy Unknown is a challenging and immersive strategy game that keeps players engaged and on edge. Darkest Dungeon is a turn-based strategy game released in 2016 that takes place in a dark and dangerous dungeon. The game follows a group of adventurers who must explore the dungeon and battle monsters while dealing with the stress and trauma of their journey. What makes Darkest Dungeon one of the most nerve-wracking strategy games of the 2010s hazards, is its unique stress by mechanic. Evil intent. As the adventurers fight their way through the dungeon, they become increasingly stressed, which can lead to a variety of negative effects like paranoia or afflictions. These conditions can cause the adventurers to act unpredictably, making battles even harder to win. Players must carefully manage their adventurous stress levels while balancing their inventory and skills to survive the increasingly difficult dungeon. When chaos the game's dark and foreboding atmosphere, along with its challenging gameplay, makes it a must-play for strategy game fans looking for a challenge. This War of Mine is a video game released in 2014. It is a strategy game where players control a group of civilians trying to survive a war. The game is set in a fictional city that is under siege and players must manage their group's resources such as food, medicine, and weapons. The game is unique because it focuses on the civilian experience of war, rather than the military or political. Players must make difficult choices, such as whether to risk going out at night to scavenge for supplies, or to stay at their shelter and defend it from intruders. The game also introduces moral dilemmas, such as whether to help strangers in need or hoard resources for oneself. This War of Mine is considered one of the, the seven nerve-wracking strategy games of the 2010s because of its intense and emotional gameplay. The game's mechanics force players to make tough decisions that have real consequences for their group's survival. The game's atmosphere, with its bleak setting and haunting soundtrack, adds to the tension, the game is a powerful reminder of the human cost of war and the struggles of those caught in the crossfire. Into the Breach is a turn-based strategy game developed by Subset Games and released in 2018. In the game, you control a team of mechs that fight against giant creatures known as the Vec. The gameplay is divided into a series of turns where you must strategically position your mechs to defend cities and complete objectives while minimizing damage and casualties. One reason why Into the casualties. Breach is considered one of the, the seven nerve-wracking strategy games of the 2010s is because of its challenging gameplay. The game requires careful planning, as even a single wrong move can lead to catastrophic consequences. The VEC are powerful and unpredictable, and each mission presents new and unique challenges that require quick thinking and strategic decision-making. Another reason why Into the Breach is so nerve-wracking is its permadeath system. If one of your mechs dies in battle, they are gone forever, making each decision that much more crucial. Additionally, the game's randomized events and levels mean that no two playthroughs are the same, 
adding to the game's replayability Overall, and tension. Into the Breach is an intense and satisfying strategy game that requires careful planning and quick thinking. Its challenging gameplay and permadeath system make it one of the most nerve-wracking strategy games of the 2010s. Frostpunk is a strategy game released in 2018 where players must lead a group of survivors in a frozen wasteland. The game is set in an alternate timeline where a volcanic eruption has caused a new ice age that threatens humanity's survival. The game is nerve-wracking because the player is forced to make tough decisions, such as choosing between sacrificing workers to keep generators running or letting them die the to game prioritize also medical treatment. The moral compass system that tracks the player's decisions and the consequences of those decisions. Frostpunk is a nerve-wracking strategy game because it forces players to make difficult choices Overall, that have lasting consequences is a and requires them to balance the needs of their city. Total War Warhammer 2 is a strategy video game released in 2017. The game takes place in a fantasy world where players can choose to play as one of four factions, each with unique abilities and units. The goal of the game is to conquer territory and defeat other factions through military and diplomatic means. The game is considered one of the seven nerve-wracking strategy games of the 2010s because it offers a challenging and engaging gameplay experience. Players must carefully manage their resources and make strategic decisions in order to succeed. The game also features impressive graphics and sound effects that immerse players in the fantasy world. Total War Warhammer 2 also offers a unique combination of real-time and turn-based gameplay. During battles, players control their armies in real-time, while the rest of the game is played on a turn-based map. This hybrid gameplay style adds an extra layer of strategy to the game. In conclusion, Total War Warhammer 2 is a compelling and challenging it's strategy engaging game gameplay that offers impressive a graphics and make it one of the standout gameplay games style. of the 2010s. RimWorld is a 2018 strategy game where players control a group of colonists trying to survive on a distant planet. The game is designed to be unpredictable, with events such as fires, raids, and disease outbreaks that can occur at any time. The game is also known for its complex AI which can lead to unexpected behaviors from both colonists and animals. RimWorld is considered one of the seven nerve-wracking strategy games of the 2010s because it forces players to constantly adapt to changing circumstances. Success in the game requires careful planning and strategic thinking, as well as the ability to make quick decisions when unexpected events occur. The game's difficulty also scales based on the player's skill, meaning that experienced players will face greater challenges. Overall, RimWorld is a challenging and rewarding strategy game that requires both tactical thinking and quick reflexes. It is a must-play for anyone who enjoys a good strategy game and is looking for a truly nerve-wracking experience.